Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Tease and I am back again with another video. Yes, guys, so if you're new to my channel, I share my experience working as a housekeeper in Oman and I also give some tips to help other housekeepers finish their contracts successfully. Yes, guys, so today's video is going to be on a question that some of you guys have been asking me, and that is that you want to start a Shagala YouTube channel like a house like an arab house help youtube channel but you're scared because some of your friends or your family don't they are working as a housemaid and you know that if you start your channel obviously they would want to watch you and they'll see what you're doing and so you're scared that they might change towards you or some some of your friends will leave you or you know i've been getting this question a lot you guys so anyways you guys i'll be sharing like a a little story with you guys about me on how some of my friends and family left and how they changed especially some of my family members how they really reached towards me and my mom okay yes guys and um i'll give you some advice also on you know how to deal with such situation how to move on and how to be the best version of yourself you guys and how to prove them wrong and make them come back to you to be like yes i know this lady i know her she's my sister she's my friend she's this she's that yes guys all of those things <laughs> yes guys anyways you guys i am not going to say this alone because i am collaborating with the amazing glad daddy yes guys i am collaborating with glad daddy on this um topic guy because she also um has some advice to give us and also she has actually gone through this type of experience before so she will give us like you know our own advice this is the second time that i'm collaborating with glad Daddy. you guys and i am super excited about this collaboration guys anyways you guys before we go into the video don't forget to like share and subscribe guys and also turn on your post notification so you'll be notified when i post the next video okay guys without further ado let us hear from glad Daddy. <laughs> everyone hello hello good afternoon good evening good evening wherever you are it depends on your time i'm saying hello to you my name is gladys i'm in nigeria based in nomara gulf country but i don't want to make this intro too long yes because this is my second time be here on this pretty this channel and i do appreciate the love and opportunity he render to give to me again to be here and i know some of you already know who i have thank you so much and i appreciate you for always be there with us supporting we harap babe Shalala. yes so so guys i'm so happy and uh, today collaboration i'm going to talk about my own experience to start a youtube as a harap shagala which i know a lot of shagalas are facing they were curious to know how i overcome it the challenges of being scared of what people will think about you working in harap as housemaid or when you start your channel what you thought uh, is going to happen or your imagination about the family you are working with or how to go about it uh, how to escape that being self uh depressed or low self-esteem battling with that that when i expose myself to the world that people is going to look down on me that the secret i'm keeping about where i am is going to be exposed calm down i guess a little answer that is just straightforward for you yes there are ways to go about it the first thing i sat down is why am i hiding i was able to give an answer to myself that what is the major reason of hiding and uh, these people that i'm hiding about did they really see me did they really know much about me did they really care about me so the answer i got from that is do what pleases you that makes you happy yes you shouldn't be thinking of others and forget yourself your personality don't hide it because you are avoiding people i don't say you should expose yourself to the world yeah but you have to do what makes you happy the most never put others people other people imagination or thinking or thought about you to be the first thing 
never never when i was able to overcome this it was then i really gained that happiness within me that i would like i i, I hope i should have come out of this shed for some long time and for how long does it take me to to come out at least i've been in hara for three years and for me to come out is i i already spent two years in hara in low key i mean in hiding not getting in touch with anybody doesn't want anybody to know where i am my way about but this doesn't help me a lot because it leads to a lot of depression and being loneliness and i believe a lot of you will be facing this so please and please come out of that shit it doesn't fit you when you notice that this is inconvenient please come out of that inconvenient inconvenient zone and move out to a joyful zone yeah and uh if you are the kind of person that you are shy or you, you don't want people to see your face there are ways to do to go about that yes it's not possible it's not necessary for you to sit down in front of camera telling people a lot about yourself you can make youtube video like cooking video or reading or telling stories without show, showing your face and you will be making money it's better you start your youtube channel right now when you are seeing harap golf country so that uh you will already have your fan base i mean the, your follower your subscriber those people that love you that will keep following you when you have good content your image has nothing to do and when we talk about our friends and family in our look in our uh, country most of these people that you you were trying to avoid yourself about or you are trying to not to show who the you are to them when you start your channel try to invite them to subscribe to your channel it was there that you know you have nobody that cares about you yes a lot of them won't even turn over you will send your link you will share a lot of your uh, video on your social platform but they won't run to you then you will realize that you are on your own please and please i believe this is going to convince you and also trigger your mindset that what you have in mind is important that you watching me right now is important that you go ahead with what you have in mind to achieve so guys thank you so much for watching i believe i don't take much of your time and to all the pretty pretty tease lover please i'll be expecting you on my channel by supporting me and i believe you guys going to stop over because i have a lot of juicy things you're going to learn i i share my experience do cooking video and also talk a lot about life of a domestic worker in hara please and please i'll be expecting you thank you so much bye love you okay guys welcome back yes guys so glad that he has said a lot and i hope that these tips that she has given us will be useful to us okay guys so i'll just add like a few points to what she has said because um let me give my own um little story first when i came to oman some of my friends and family did not know about this okay so when some family member knew about this you guys they said a lot of negative things about me and my mom most but most especially like um i've gone to become a prostitute in the arab country my mom has sold me to an arab man for money and a lot of things you guys so people that I actually put in high esteem, you guys, like they really fold my hand. So, anyways, you guys, some friends actually also changed. Some some of them became curious that um am I sleeping with the men here for money and all of that. So, if you can think about that of me, how would I even remain friends with you? That's what I'm saying, guys. So a lot of things changed, you guys. So I I now sat down and I told myself that is it worth holding on to these people? That is one thing that you should ask yourself. Like, are they scared of losing you? Yeah, are they scared of not being your friend again? Are they scared of not, like, um, being a part of your life? The people in your life, the friends in your life, or the family in your life. Like, ask yourself, are they adding to your life or they are subtracting from your life? Ask yourself, are they bringing positivity to your life, okay? Or they are only bringing negativity to your life? Are they using you? In one way or the other, what are the things that they've done for you when you when you call them when you call them or when you need them? Are they always there for you? Don't be worried about five people not being there for you. Don't be worried about two people not being there for you. Don't be worried about one person not being there for you because 
later you have like people that you yourself you want to be running like huh so face these people oh my god yeah you have a lot of people you have a lot of friends that you are even the one that will choose which one do i want to be my friend among those people yes guys imagine me worrying about about five ten or twenty people now do you know how many friends and family i have you guys i have over ten thousand friends and family yeah, that I don't even know how to even reply. Sometimes when I'm replying to comments, it has to be very, very fast because I want to quickly reply to everybody. <laughs> Can you imagine? Do you know people that DM me every day? That I, that I am always trying to, like, you know, reply to their DM just to, like, be communicating and be, you know, close to you guys. Is that where I'm doing that one? Is that when do I have time to be thinking about one family member or friend that doesn't even have my time? It is even good for you to start now so that you will know those that will be there for you and those that will not be there for you. The only thing I want you to do is to work hard, be successful, and to be able to prove those ones wrong. Yes, if anybody is going to leave, let them leave. They don't want you, like they, you don't like they don't deserve you. That is just they don't deserve you it is their loss if they leave you that is what you should know it is their loss if they leave you so anyway so guys this is the advice that i will actually give you guys okay guys so after you've decided okay to start to like let go of things that are not worth it to let go of people that they are not worth to be your friends or your family it is now time for you to start your channel right yes guys so anyway so guys on glad diaries channel i actually talked about how to start your channel like maybe extra gala channel or any channel you want to start i and glad diary also gave like some tips and advice on how to start your channel and how to make your channel grow so you guys don't forget to check glad diary's channel out to you know watch that video and also to support her and you know let us help her to get to 1000 subscribers guys yes she's actually an amazing person and we've worked together this is the second time and this is not the last time guys yeah so anyway see guys thank you so much for watching i love you guys so so much and i hope that this tip will help you guys to you know be yourself and be the best version of yourself yes guys so anyways guys it's time for some shout out today shout out goes to every one of you guys thank you so much for all the birthday wishes okay yes because i'm choosing everybody because I, it is going to be unfair for me to choose some people that wish me happy birthday everybody wish to me happy birthday so thank you guys so so much i love you guys so so much Anyway, so guys, I don't want you to ever forget that you are amazing, you are pretty, you're beautiful. And yes, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.